from here. You, you, Rufus and Henry, come right on in here away from that old Bad Johnson boy. Well, he's you send Bad Johnson, give him right back that cake. Well, there he is. What is the matter, sugar? Don't just... You send Bad Johnson, I'm going to tell your pappy on you. Do you need me, Mammy? No, I don't need you. Well, I'm going. Where? I'm going to lick that sin Bad Johnson. You go and kick him on the shins from me. Oh, common price, I sure would be glad when they rid the neighborhood of such as him. Don't you worry, honey. Oh, Sinbad Johnson sure is going to be sorry when he find out what a great man you is. Is I going to be a great man, Mammy? You sure is. You's going to be president. Me? Sure. They has kings your age. I don't see no reason why they can't have presidents. Besides, the book says anybody born here can be a president. Ain't that something? Stay on your own side of the fence. Don't try to cross the line Just like a cloud that's dark and dense You have a silver lining All God's children, they got wings Honey But you stay on your own side of the fence, and no harm will come to you. Yes, sir, honey, you sure is going to be president. I can see you now. to change the election. All signs point to the discriminated election of Rufus Jones. Rufus Jones wins. <laughs>
Because when I get through, son, I declare that you is why be the president. Now, first of all, swear to me, from now on, Pope Shop will be free. I do. I do. Now, swear to me, instead of a boost, that the tax on razors must be reduced. I do. I do. Now, make a law without no loot, that there'll be no knock on the chicken coop. Swear to me that you will choose for the national anthem, the milk is blue. Swear that walk the mill and vine are public property at all times. I do, I do. Now swear to me that you will not be nice to anyone caught with loaded dice. I do, yeah, man, I do. Now if there is no argument, I pronounce you the joke for the president. <laughs> The president. All the great they come. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. coming home with no headaches from running this government. So I've nominated myself to the office of the President S. <laughs> and I'm also raring to take up with y'all some matters of the most inconspicuous importance. Yeah. Yeah. First, we'll add to our official family a commissioner of poultry. Uh, what is the duties of the commissioner of uh, poultry? Yeah. 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 Oh, uh, it's the duty to see that all the padlocks is first removed from the coops. Right. Because when a chicken is in a hurry, he don't want to be bothered with no padlock. <laughs> right, brother, right. We have now constituted a watermelon investigator. It will be his duty to plant the watermelon vines near the fence instead of in the middle of the path. Uh, but President S. is going to take a long time to do all of this. So what shall we do in the meantime? Remove the fences. <laughs> I object. What are we coming to? Are we all going to sit around here with such great supreme authority and let her tell us what to do? <laughs> Why, Senator, you should be ashamed of yourself. Just look at the presidentess. Can't you see what those hard words have did to her? What's the matter, Mammy? You 